Alright, folks! Let's get this party started here. And yes, update the 39th is now officially, I believe, available as usual. Plus, it was all these nice and neat little stuff here. It's now live on all console, all places, and it has given us this neat little stuff here. Huh? But yeah, it gives us all the neat new little things. That being said... <laughs> Let's get this party started, folks. And yes, it's my ugly ass taking us through it here again. As soon as it loads up, that is. There we go. Hopefully everybody's doing alright. I know I... Having my fun stuff here. So... Ahead and not delay any longer, and we need to. And we're in the middle of an undaunted celebration. Reward boxes for defeating final dungeon bosses. Acquire opal max shoulder and weapon styles from boxes and bosses. So. While we're here, let's head to Stros Mackay. Alrighty then. Step one, find Howler. Okay. 
There we go. Well, you aren't at all what I was expecting. Well, I doubt it. Let's talk. You shall. What brings you to this trash pit? Um... Well, it's obviously not the dining, but... Just for the purposes of moving the plot along... How did you do that? Question mark. Up on you? It's what I do. Howler draws all the attention, I do all the sneaking. Now answer my question. Oh. What are you doing here? Well, Captain Colleen needs some help. She got a big heist plan. My ship may be a pile of driftwood, but my crew's alive, and Captain Helene has them. I won't leave without them. Help me rescue my crew, and I'll help you with Colleen's heist. All right, we'll do it together. I didn't expect to get help so quickly. Remind me to thank Colleen when we're done here. So, what's the plan? We're going to disguise my crew as sea drakes. Take these clothes. Look for a portly Breton, a sour red guard, and a big orc. The drakes are keeping them in the large buildings. Once they're out, meet me by Helene's ship. What if I need a disguise? Look for hampers with clothes, or kill a sea drake and take theirs. Put on their clothes and you'll look just lovely. Oh, do watch out for the sea drakes with torches. They're not drunk. If you get too close, they'll spot you and alert the others. Good to know. Let's get this done. Remember, you can take clothes from hampers or off-dead sea drakes. All right. There we go. Sky shard right now. And then go and do this. Above, so there's the orc. You're going to kill me. Get it over with. Not gonna kill you, Larissa sent me. Done this, and then sneak your way out. Ah, another of Helene's tricks. Let me go, then chase me down and beat me within an inch of my life. I'll chance it and make a run for Port Hunding. See how far I get. Alright. Word of advice. Don't let them capture you. If you can't get away, die fighting. Good to know. There we go. Choke and die, Sea Drake. I'll spit on your grave. Temper, temper. Larissa sent me. I got some free you can use to escape. I knew she wouldn't leave me to rot. Quick, untie me. The Sea Drake spent the past few hours breaking my fingers. I can't wield a sword, but I can still strangle a few on my way out. Alrighty then, let's do this. These sea drakes give pirates a bad name. Kill every last one of them you see. Ah! 
Uh, please don't beat me again. Larissa sent me take this and get out of here. Thank the eight. I thought I'd die in here. Helene came by not long ago. Told me to look forward to a public flaying. Then she beat me bloody, laughing the whole time. She's one cold witch. That's one word for it. Let's get you out of those ropes. Stay away from Helene. She's a monster. Here we go. Welcome sight. I've rescued everyone but Crenard, Hairden, and Meekog. Any luck? Found all three, they're safe. Almost done then. Everyone's out except my first mate, Dara Gore. They've got him in the belly of Helene's ship. You'll find the keys below deck. Look for Dara Gore down and back. How did you make yourself look like a fern? Like that. Did I really disguise myself as a fern? Or did you see a fern because you weren't looking close enough? Cute. What are you going to do while I rescue Derigor? I'll be visiting Helene in her cabin to thank her for the hospitality she's extended my crew. Come on up after you release Derigor. You should really say hello. It's a date. Though, how do, I do have to ask for uh, obvious legal purposes. How did you get the key to Helene's quarters? The cabin girl had a key. Poor little Bosmer lass. Barely any meat on her bones. I think Helene was starving her. She's on her way to Port Hunding now, and I'm one key richer. Alrighty then. Bloody Witch Storeroom. Derigor. I'm not telling you anything, scum! What have you done with Captain Larissa? Actually, Larissa sent me to rescue you. Yeah? Ha! I knew she got away! Helene said she was being keel hauled and beat. Hold still. Captain Larissa never leaves anyone behind. Make sure she's safe. Don't worry, that's my next stop. And now we talk to Cla Crafty Larissa again. My, that felt good. I bet it did. I do have to technically ask just to move the plot along. What did you do to her? Question mark. Me? Did I do that? 
Her starving little cabin girl may have poisoned her drink. Who can say? Did Daragor get out? Well, yep, he's free. I'll just be going then. I told my crew to gather on the beach. I'm going to make sure they all made it out. Meet me there and we'll square up. What kind of poison did you use on Helene? I'm actually kind of curious because I may want to get a sample. Unrelated asshole. Oh, it's Yarn Root. A very nasty local poison. It won't kill her. Not right away. It starts by dissolving the stomach lining, then goes from there. Yarin Roots. Is that with a J or a Y? Um, and also, uh, how much and how long? Oh, also. I do have to ask if you're just going to leave Helene here to die here. I'd love to stay and watch, but no time. You can stay if you like. It's actually her poison, kept for slaves who disobey. There's an antidote on the dresser if your heart bleeds enough. Uh huh. Well. Well, you know me, I'm pretty much sitting dead center in the alignment chart on this, but... I do have to ask for, uh, plot purposes, what would you do if I gave Helene the antidote question mark? Mildly disappointed, but I leave it up to you. Meet me on the beach once you're done here and we'll settle up. Just watch your boots. She'll start vomiting soon. Thanks for the heads up. Okay, we actually got three options here. We can either grab the antidote and give it to Helene. Mercy kill Helene. And then or walk out the door and let her die slowly. Let her live. Swiftly kill her. Or let the poison take its course. Decisions, decisions. Well, to quote the Eric Andre show, we'll be right back.
Radio, then let's get back into it. Much better. So, do, do, do. like I said, we sit dead center in the alignment chart. Yes, a quick little thing here with the new update. I'm gonna do a quick run through of this. As you can see, they've changed up quite a bit of stuff, so. And, uh... Profit and base game main quest bestowers now appear in chapter and DLC cities after you see after only after you hit level five. Ditto with Fighters Mages Guild quests. Uh, the reworked Fighters Guild bestowals in all zones. So basically, the bestowals for Fighter Guild quests have been reworked so that Vera does not. Fucking try and stalk you from here to Kingdom Come during the city. Instead, she'll try to wait patiently at the guild entrance to flag you down. Basically, when you go into a city, you won't have anybody saying, Comrade, a word! Which, of course, will ruin the fact. Ruin one of my favorite leaves. Comrade, a word. Banana. At least ways. It makes it a little bit more hard to deal with, but that's all. These Guild and Dark Brotherhood Vector Quests now require you to be at least level 5. These are still available at any level within their respective zones. Room Despair is now only visible to players at level 6 or higher. 
And the quest is now more consistently available across locations. So Rin Gerard no longer yells at you to learn how to play tribute in high play in places outside High Isle, where you reach at least level six. Availability of crafting certification has been standardized to level six in most locations. Stowers for Delve, World Event, and World Boss Daily Quests will now only be available to players level seven or above. Or if shared. Ball roll! Undaunted daily quest givers only going to be visible to players seven or level seven or above. Daily quest bestowers from Fighters and Mages Guild now only visible to players level seven or above. Bestowers for Battleground and Undaunted. I I'm sorry. Who decided? Why do you fucking go with Mercy? Yeah. Sorry, I had to deal with this here in the game. Somebody decided to choose the unmerciful approach. But. This enemy. Anyways, back to this. Bestowers for a Battleground and Undaunted Intro Quest will now be only visible to players 10 and above, level 10 and above. Bestowers for Zone Vectoring Quests like Craglorn will now be visible only to players level 15 and above. Bestowers for Prologue Quests... It's level 15 and above. Bestowers for Trial Intro Quests will now only be available to players level 15. And above in cities, but you can still get them in the trials themselves at any point. <sighs> Door pin is should be showing up here. It means that this is the Transits area. And they also have a door icon that will say give you the fast travel option. That come from oh, and new safety rail or event tickets that come from looted sources and only looted. As quest ones already have a warning about this when you go to turn them in. Grab a little tissue too quickly. Ooh. Yeah. When you complete an action which would have dropped event tickets while out or near the event currency cap and not on daily cooldown. You'll now receive a message letting you know you could have gotten event tickets from this source but didn't have enough room to loot them. Once you spend enough the tickets to properly loot additional tickets, you'll be able to loot them from the next event appropriate source. And your event tickets because you forgot, crashed, or because an asteroid hit your hometown unit just arrived and lost the internet. Aha. Mm -hmm. That's appropriate over time. New Cyrodiil Monster Mask, you can pay some body markings, death notifications. Improved Imperial City Treasure Scan Loot. New and updated achievements. Updates to item set sourcing. Mm -hmm. 
more than fixed the number of item set curation issues in the Craglorn trials. They've adjusted locations of some item sets. The shared set pool is now being broken up, and each trial will now drop four sets. AA, good. Let's see. Theory and Archive will be doing Defending Warrior, Healing Mage, Infallible Mage, and Quick Serpent, Hellrock, Citadel. Circing Warrior, Destructive Mage, Eternal Warrior, Poison Serpent, Sanctum of Phidia. Immortal Warrior, Twice Fang Serpent, Victorious, Vicious Serpent, and Wise Mage. Discrepancy in item slot sourcing, Valerio and Ethereum Archival Node, Drop Head, Chest, Shoulder, and Leg Set Pieces. The two Atronauts will drop hand based on feet. Getting in Crag 1, Trial and Normal will award blue quality gear. Getting in Trial and Veteran will award purple. With jewelry retention becoming gold. Delves Bane. Well, that's uh, stacking of identical crown store items. ahead and uh, as you can see here, I've decided in the end we're just going to let him die slowly. Now let's get back to work. Crew's safe, and only a little bit tortured. I call that a win. She did. Oh, many a captain who sails these waters will be glad of that. She's a bit too obsessed with old Faharajad for me, but I like her style. You! Hey, you! Hey, you! Yeah, you! Who? <laughs> I didn't think I'd ever find you. You move around. Can I help? I'm Nicoline. I work for Captain Colleen. She sent me to find you, see if you'd had any luck recruiting for our heist. Looks like you're already making new friends. You could say that. And listen, just so you know, we're set up in a hideout near the- There's Find you when I'm ready. Captain Colleen wants to help with her heist. Crafty Larissa, Jakarn, and Naramo. She told me about him. Who do you want to know about? Tell me about Naramo. He's a brilliant Dwemer sage. Not that he's Dwemer himself, but he studies them. He's out of Bith's Ark, digging in the ruins there. And you leave on Jakarn? He was tossed in the grave. It's the prison beneath Hedman Bosek's palace. He throws people in there to forget about him. You can get in through the tunnel off the river. Just watch out for the traps. There's lots of traps. All right. You do. Soiled by bandits and thieves. Yet I cannot get it. Miraculous. With the folk, none can dim. Bosek's punishments Steal from Bosek beheading. Touch Bosek's girls' gelding. 
Axel boasts at 20 lashes. Don't pay taxes, tight cage. Kill a fist the grave. Steal a fist. Kill a fist. Hands cut off. Rat to the needy, tongue cut out. Rat to Helene, keel hollow. J. Do do do. Uh. There we go. There's the Zark. And you thought you could fuck with me, bitch. Silly bitch. Silly bitch. There we go. Primary one. Yeah. I've lost right. the spider, but I must be able to control it. That reminds me. Did you find the crystals? Yep, yep. Splendid. Now, I just... Let's All see. Alright. You work on that. I'm gonna go ahead and... Uh... I knew it would, of course. Into the tunnel you go. Now to get that door open. Mm -hmm. At long last, the Sark. Come. We'll talk of our next move inside. Let's do this. As you see, 
Headman Bosek's trust in my skills was not misplaced. Nor was my faith in... Oh. Mm -hmm. This control rod... Okay. East and then west. Yeah, let's get the near man. There we go. Bitsark breathes again. I'm listening. We are not the first to enter Bitsark. In truth, I accepted Bosek's request to explore these ruins only because they contain something I want. Something I believe others died trying to obtain. And that is? Knowledge is the greatest treasure. The Dwemer guarded their secrets as a king protects his gold. In Bizarre, the Dwemer hid a set of skills. Need my help. An easy task. There may be more. To the assembly chamber. So, the schematics were here. I doubt they escaped. I'm the dead bastard's journal. These writings could be crucial to understand the schematics. Continue looking for the schematics. Did Robert's claims to be true? We found this out working really did come this far. Still, I've watched him closely, never trust because she clever bastard's dwarfs the right most rich character traps the left the hidden constructs. Only way past is to sneak. All in our own is tomes, just what we're looking for. The elf tells us nothing of the chest sealed shut, trapped skittering in the pipes. We go just straight blast through and there we go now we got the schematics I was just coming to, uh, help you. I hope you found what we were looking for. Yep. schematics are mine at last. I hear Killeen intends to head towards the Isle of Betnik. The ruins there greatly interest me. But I must All right. have schematics to my workshop. Join me if you wish to return to town. Come, Clanker. We'll do that. Good to see you back in one piece. Mm -hmm. I still got one more thing to do. 
grab a pretty boy. Jakan is innocent. Edmund Bosek threw my sweet Jakan into the grave. Jakan is buried. No, no. The grave is the prison in that cave ahead. Jakan described it as a ghastly place. Traps block the exit, and most criminals roam freely inside. Gods no, he's rich. He's a prince from Glenumbra. He promised oh. to whisk me away from my family and make me his princess. But now he's going to die in the grave while I'm forced to return home. I'll see what we can do. So, you may want to hold on to your uh, hopes and dreams there a bit. The Khan said the gate in the cave is never locked. Because, yes, from Westry. How I long to travel there with him. He described it as bright, beautiful, and full of life. It's beneath the palace, and anyone thrown in dies there. Traps, guards, and other prisoners prevent them. Disgusting. Uncultured. Devious. His guards are criminals, and his laws benefit only himself. Elves. Is it true Jakarn stole the gem? That's what the headman claims. That's what got him thrown into the grave. And you're looking for a stolen djinn that may or may not exist. You mocking me? The headman makes the laws. It's my job to punish anyone who breaks them. Now beat it before I toss you in the grave. Yeah, you're gonna have a hard time tossing me anywhere, bitch. An elf named Yurian sent me to find you. Yurian? Altmer girl? Yeah, I promised her a way. Did you steal? Important right now. Bosek stole it from someone else. Can't steal from a thief. Do you get me out of it? There we go, there we go, and there we go. I owe you for this. Thanks. Now, let's get out of here. First. Must you bother me? Mm-hmm. We can't go that way, Eerie. Why not? Owen, guards. 
Ugh. Really? I will take the side entrance. Ooh, man horse. Say. Thanks for breaking me out back there. Listen, while you're in a heroic mood, want to help me get something I left with the guy? Uh -huh. If you want something kept safe, give it to the goblins. They'll watch it for free. They're too stupid to trade it. And they'll kill anyone who tries to take it. Won't they kill you if you try to take it? Here's the thing. You went through a lot of trouble to free me, right? There's no way you'll let me get eaten by goblins. So you, my good friend, will follow me to their mine. Yeah? I'm only doing this solely on the grounds that I have to be alive to collect the reward money. This way. Why am I getting an offer to group up? Why am I here? Am I going mad? No, not mad, just you know. Get in a goblet mine, they said. It'll be kept safe, they said. They store everything on the upper level. This is the part where I trust you. What are you talking about? I'll kill the goblins in the scaffolding in the next room. You grab the gem. It's in a chest on the floor. There's a path. Over here, I have a question for you. What were you doing in the mine? And did you see a scummy Breton up there? What 
What were you doing in the mine? And did you see a scummy Breton up there? Well, my business in the mine is my own. And I see a lot of scummy Bretons. You're going to have to be a bit more specific. What was the name of this said scummy Breton? Yakarn. He's a liar and a thief. He stole a gem from headman Bosek. Now, if the gem came back, Bosek might let him live. Can you help me or not? Sorry, haven't seen him. Now that's just too bad. If you do run into him again, tell him that if we catch him, he's dead. Alrighty then. Alrighty then, we'll just hop on over to here, to the inn, and... Bastard! If you're looking for that bastard Jakan, he's at the tavern with a red guard girl. What happened? I overheard him telling a red guard girl he'd whisk her off to Sentinel, that he was a ship captain, she swooned like a fool, like I did. I'd tell the headman where he's hiding if I didn't hate the headman more. I need off this island. The Screaming Mermaid. Oh, well, you kind of have to expect when you're going into a dive bar like this that you're going to deal with man horse. Karn's gorgeous. He could rob me anytime. I don't believe a word Jakarn says. But there's just something about him. He's fascinating. Yep. I don't really believe he's a captain. He looks so good, I don't care. Hey there. Glad to see you made it out. Here's the gem you stole. Hey now, the headman stole it first. And you brought it back to me, didn't you? Thanks, good looking. You owe me for freeing you, Captain Colleen needs an assist. Seeing as it's you asking, sure. If she's planning a job, I'm in. All I ask is a trip off this rock after it's over. Deal. And I do believe that's actually it on the recruiting trip. So, Mm -hmm. 
Sorry. Put that here, you're just gonna grab. No, no, no. It's not how it was. Were too. She didn't want to stop reading. Ha ha ha. Ha ra ha ra. The king made her. You don't know nothing. Do too, you drunk. In the morning, I'll be sober, but you'll still be stupid. Ha! You won't be sober in the morning. That is a nice way of saying you a lush. Captain's looking for you. What's going on? Thanks to your work, we can go. There we go. You're back. Found anyone else to help? Ha! I knew you'd get it done. Who needs the old crew? Those traitors. When we've got you helping us. Boy. Captain Colleen. We've got a crew to rival the legends. Now we're ready Whoa. for the real challenge. The His sailing logs are the key to our fortune, friend. They're the records Whoa. of every ship that's docked here, every stolen cargo they've unloaded, and every illicit payment made to Bosek. And that makes us rich how? Those records are worth a fortune to King Vaharajad. They're written proof that Bosek has violated the King's order to stop raiding Breton shipping. With those papers in hand, the King can threaten to destroy Bosek if he doesn't stop. And the King's agreed to pay for him. Absolutely. His envoy is on the dock now, waiting. As soon as we turn over the sailing logs, he gives us a fortune in gold. The trick will be getting into Bosek's palace, stealing the logs, and getting out with them. That's your job. You up you Ocean's Eleven. First, you need a servant's disguise. The lockbox. Oh, yes. Hello. I can offer help with the guard. I removed this device from Clanker. When pressed, it produces quite the incapacitating shock. If you let me know if there are any lingering effects. Twitching, mainly. I'm quite curious about the twitching. Oh. It's a wonderful day for a sailing trip, isn't it, friend? Especially if it gets me off this rock before Bosek chops off my head. Bosek keeps the key around his neck, cinched steel. Get your disguise and meet me out back. Ooh, All right. She's right. You need to discuss my pleasure. And now he just made this about 75,000 times easier. Who's come to pay a visit? Oh yes, uh -huh. try these on. All right, let's go ahead and pop on this set of disguise. What is it now? 
Are you seeing him in those? Shouted at you too, did he? He just went out back to carouse with the latest slatterns from the mainland. Best hurry up and refill his drink. You don't want him running out of drink. Alrighty then. Looks like Hedden and Vosik had a bit too much. Ah, my lowly servant. You're just in time. What happened to Vosik? My dear friend Headman Vosik is sleeping off the attentions of these two lovely ladies. They are quite a handful, and an eyeful, too. Why don't you take the good Headman's key inside for safekeeping? I'll do that. Going to want to talk to you, Walker. has been dealt with now. So... My friend, welcome back. The king is pleased with what you've done. My friend, welcome back. Do you have some good news? Uh, yes, shipping logs here. Here, moment. The king is pleased with what. My friend, welcome back. Here you are, Tharwab. The shipping logs that show Bosek's defiance of the king's decrees. Uh -huh. Come on, it's time to go. And that actually gets us a nice good thing On here. Your feet. Man your stations. Prepare to sail. Stros Mackay's a depressing place. Too many Red Guards waving their damn swords around. At least on the spearhead, no one wants to kill me except Irian. She'll come around. She's crazy about me. Home to Betnik. I've missed my clan. When active, Duema spiders have an extraordinary capacity for learning. Now I have to stop Andrillium from teaching Clanker to bring him drinks. You'll have uh, better luck trying to, te trying to keep from teaching the mixed drinks. And then you'll really be in the suit. What do you want? You're dealing with this. Of course. I'll pull my weight, unlike Jakarn. He's not getting near another woman until I'm too old to stop him. And we Altburn live a very long time. To be on the seas once again. 
This is paradise. I'm looking forward to seeing Jakarn in action. Following Jakarn, of course. Jakarn fanboy. I can't wait to see Jakarn's back. Plane's edge. We're setting sail with the famous Jakarn. Wherever Captain Larissa goes, I go. Even on this tub. Spirit is a good ship, but she's no maiden's breath. At least she'll get us away from Stros Mackay. This should be an interesting voyage. Quite a crew Colleen has thrown together. Yeah. Vive me la croix. I'm a collector of sorts. One who travels to places others dare not go. I hope to join Naramo's expedition to Bizarre. When I heard he had completed it and was sailing on, I just had to come along. Mm -hmm. You're inquisitive. What I do, I do well. You'll be glad to have me on this voyage if we encounter slavers. And I make a Wicked Sliced Ale. Alright, well you just... That Wicked Sliced Ale is definitely the big one. Mr. Kassan, is he? Again, sailors flock to the spearhead. For this, Kassan is thankful. Ooh. Master Kazan is but a humble sailor. Though others will tell you stories. Some whisper the name Kassan Fiveclaw. Terror of the seas. Yet yeah, these are stories for children. We have better things to do with our time, yes? What can you tell me about the captain? Some call her the Dune Ripper's daughter, others the Forebear Witch. We, her loyal crew, call her Captain Galeen. She is a master sailor, though Kassan now wonders where her allegiance lies. What does she mean? There is a Forebear King and Sentinel now, Faharajad. He has allied himself with the Bretons and Orcs in this Daggerfall Covenant. Kassan fears his apprentice thinks much of Harjad. Too much. A true sea rover has no such loyalties. She's your apprentice. Kassan taught Kalin much. Though she is her own woman, strong and proud, Kassan is grateful to help her find her way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Master Kassan! Oh well, yeah, it's a beat. Ah. I knew Captain Colleen would get another crew together. When she wants the spearheads the fastest galleon on the seas. Master Kassan gave her to Captain Colleen when he retired. He taught her all she knows about the sea. She's amazing. She's well, it's kind of embarrassing. But funny. I did steal it. She didn't even notice it was gone until I was halfway down the street. <laughs> but boy, did she get after me. She can run. When she caught me, I thought I was dead, but she offered me a job. She was impressed. She joined her crew. She said it was a good lift. Taking her purse, I mean. And offered me an apprenticeship. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't sneak up on me. I was quartermaster, for now. But Captain Larissa's hoping to get her own ship again. Can't hold a sword yet, but I can hold a book. Letter to Captain Larissa. Nicolene's diary private. I must finish this. Hmm. 
How did they eat this stuff? I'm going to teach Fen one of the finest, my good friend. Hungry? Mm -hmm. Who of the spearhead grows again? I did not think you're on the spear. I am one of Captain Colleen's few remaining loyal. Both your bone two dice three cards hack. I'll be at this again tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Now I've been ordered to follow Naramo on another fool's errand. Mm -hmm. At least the drinks are free. There you go. Back to the rest of the hell. That's no maiden's breath, but at least she doesn't have a giant hole in her side. Lambor. Captain Colleen took her time getting off this damned island. Doesn't surprise me. Orc problems aren't her problems. But we'd be stuck here if not for your help. I won't forget that. Before we leave for Betnik, talk to the crew. Get familiar with them. Then we leave right. for Betnik, an orc island that hasn't yet joined the Covenant. I hope to change that. Lem mm -hmm. is happy to go home. She may try to thank you with ale. My advice? Make it to six mugs. You'll have a friend for life. All right. Onward to Betnik. There we go. When my crew head into town and get a drink, this is how careful here. These orcs aren't yet part of the covenant, but they aren't fools. Proud as the Seamount clan are, they can't deny the covenant's strength in numbers, and they'll make a mountain of coin selling weapons to our alliance. Okay. Alrighty then. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Keep your weapon sheathed, newcomer. Yeah, Good thing you sailed in with Captain Colleen. Outsiders aren't welcome on Betnik, especially not now. What's going on? Bloodthorn cultists attacked the fortress. 
You're lucky you don't look like them, or you'd have a spear in your belly. Well, it looks like things failed, which is a good sign. Of course, we slaughtered most, the rest fled. We stole something from the chief, but we'll get it back. We'll mop them up as soon as Chief Tazgal raises the army. You want to know more? Ask Lamour. I'll go check her. I'll go search her out and. This was part of a larger plan. I'm this was part of a larger plan. I'm sure of it. All right. Well, actually, I gotta. Get... This was part of a larger plan. I'm what sure happened? Ethel and Colt assaulted the fortress. They were repulsed, but they stole a Breton scroll the orcs found here long ago. Chief Tazgol thinks the attack failed, but I'm not so sure. What do you mean? The cultists retreated after the initial assault. They came here to steal that scroll, I'm sure of it. But why? Have they set a trap for us? We must know before the chief decides to attack. How can I help? With Shaman Laganak. She witnessed bloodthorn rituals in the carved hills. She's waiting by the longhouse south of here. Cultists were also seen at Morricelli to the north, and Grimfield west of here. What can you tell me about Morricelli? It's an alien ruin. Years ago, Breton raiders attacked us. An outnumbered patrol held there for weeks until they were wiped out. Later, our army destroyed the raiders. It's just a ruin, really. I don't know what the Bloodthorn want with it. And what about Grimfield? The name kind of sounds slightly ominous. It's a graveyard. Not ours. Breton. When we conquered the islands hundreds of years ago, War Chief Isgul left it intact out of respect for our enemies. Mm -hmm. We don't desecrate graves, but the Bloodthorn cult will. Plenty of fresh bodies. Mm -hmm. What do you know about the Carved Hills? It's mostly wilderness. There are alien ruins, but they were looted long ago. I don't know what the Bloodthorns want there, but Lagan. Lagan can probably tell us more. Blah 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 blah. You stand on orc soil, Outland. Vile scum called the Bloodthorn cult. Mm -hmm. I got the name from one of the survivors before I split his skull. They're necromancers, defilers of the dead. We taught them a lesson. They won't be back. Only knows, and I don't care. Whatever the reason, they died poorly and in great numbers. And they took, and I heard they took something. A few broke into my library, probably just to hide. Some old Breton scrolls are missing, likely destroyed in the attack. Breton scrawlings, bah! If they came for those, they wasted their lives. Mm -hmm. Let me go ahead and go after them here because let's just say. When I feel the itch in the back of the skull, it usually means either one of two things. Hot's kicking in. Or... Those scrawlings may end up leading him to something... interesting.
The Ghana. Trust you are here to help. Dark rituals are being performed around the island. I first smelled the corruption on the wind. Then my shaman found evidence at an alien ruin nearby. Who's performing the rituals? The same cult that attacked the fortress. I sense a link between the attack and the rituals. There is a way to be certain. Chief Tazgol has forbidden me from pursuing this, so I ask you to. Ow. By the bridge to the south is a totem. Those who touch it see visions. You journey into danger. All right. And remembers those who. Vision totem check. Activate. She should be nearby. Mm -hmm. You have the scroll. Rejoice that you did not fail. Varden will be pleased. I live to serve my masters. Go west to the Aeliad site. The scroll's ritual should enable you to succeed where the others failed. I will not fail you, mistress. Grab that. Read the scroll. The ritual it holds will send you into the spirit realm. Should you succeed, I will follow. In the name of the Bloodthorns, enter the spirit realm. Failure again. Perhaps an ancient curse lingers here. I will try the ritual in our lair. Well, look who's here. Let me guess, you want into the Bloodthorn's secret lair? I unburdened their secret entrance of its lock.
am extremely glad that the fucking bow combat is fucking awesome here. It's like, if I had a bow and I can fucking do this, it's like, yes. This place reminds me of the grave. Great memories. Mm -hmm. Why do evil lairs always smell so bad? Skater to OSHA requirements. I've got your back, good looking. place clean later. Ask them to leave the island. I can enter the spirit realm. The next phase of our mission can begin. Varden's Diary. I'll catch up with you later. These blood thorns. <laughs> Turn. What did you learn of the Bloodthorn plans? They're desperate to enter some sort of spirit realm. The fools! Did they succeed? Unfortunately, yes. The dangers that face us become clearer. I will try to convince Chief Tazgol of this, though I doubt he will accept the word of an outsider. Your efforts on our behalf bring you honor. All right. to the next gig.
Hold it. Stop right there. No one Bloodthorn mm -hmm. cult. Ha! An army? These are Breton zombies. Flimsy little bodies in the ground. They'll die easy. Still, if you feel like slaughtering cultists, I won't stop you. Start with the crypt in the center. I s you get into trouble mm -hmm. on your own. Alright. Well, we're at the Breton graveyard in the Betnik. I'm fairly certain this is an orc island. This was a Breton island, hundreds of years ago. War Chief Isgul and the Seamount Orcs wiped them out. The Seamounts were the fiercest raiders on the sea until we settled here. And what's so special about that? Steel and stone, how could you ask? High, defensible cliffs, a view of all approaches from the fortress, fertile land for crops. What's not to like? Isgul's wives insisted we settle here, so we did. Smart move, those wives. If you own the island, though, why leave the Breton graveyard intact, though? We're not savages. We respect the enemy's dead. When an orc dies, he gets a cairn to mark where he fell, weapons atop it. We don't stick our dead in the ground like Bretons. Even so, we won't desecrate their graves. Mm hmm And I take it you haven't dealt with zombies themselves there. I watch them until they try to break out, or until Chief Tazgul gets here and cuts off their heads. That's all. An orc follows orders, even if they're stupid. Fair point. It Let's get this sky shard here. <laughs> it should get us through that way.
Alrighty. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. Take the staff of Arke, a pope. Mm -hmm. Greetings, stranger. You are not a cultist. Help us mm -hmm. defeat these necromancers. Ow. The staff of Arke, a pope right. blasphemers. In life, I was a priestess of Arke. I served King Renwick for many years. I was with him when the Seamount or many died under their blades. But that was long ago. Even in death, I watch over my people. Necromancy is a crime against Arke. The aura of corruption builds as my countrymen's bodies, the Bloodthorn cults, necromancy. Mm -hmm. Well now, what have we here? Out for a stroll, enjoying the scenery? All right. I'll be hunting cultists. One drain staff of Arke. Hold the lettuce. Remember, you gotta kill. Oh, you gotta kill the cultists in order to get the moats. Fully charged. Quickly, meet me at my tomb. I see we great go. power in the staff. The staff All right. the circles of corruption. Eight breath and fear.
done. Meet me at the west end of the graveyard. Now we can do this. Thorn's perversion of my the cult. And now we can do it. Tempted necromancy. An ancient alien relic is buried on this island. The blood. Alrighty then. Ooh. Targoth. The Breton king has sealed himself deeper in the ruin. He is preparing some foul spell. Those I know spells. only that the magic he summons will slaughter our army. Unless we stop him, every orc here will die. How do we stop Renwick? We must learn how to reach their cowardly king and the nature of his foul magic. Make these prisoners talk. We have confiscated their belongings. They may hold clues to what they know. How far do we go? The code of Malak is clear. So long as these Bretons aid their king in his foul magic, they remain our enemies. If you can coerce them through words alone, do so. If not... Blood price? They must pay the blood price. I took this charm off a Reach Witch. Hold it tight and order any guard to execute his prisoner. The charm will chain their soul and compel them to answer you. You will have one question, Targoth. Ask wisely. I don't want any more trouble. Alrighty then. Oh. Oh. How much more blood do you want? You. How much more blood do you want? Answer truthfully, you live. Lying, you die. 
You've invaded my home. You've slaughtered my people. Why would I help you, Orc? You'll kill us all anyway. Tell me how to open the door that hides Renwick or your daughter dies. Vizan? No, she's just a child. You cannot kill our child. You wish to save her life? Tell me how to reach Renwick. No, Renwick, forgive me. There are crystals in... Save me! Bandit. Butcher. I am not afraid. I know nothing about his plans. I thought orcs had honor. Now you threaten unarmed prisoners? Savage orc. Do what you will. I will. Please. Don't kill me. Over here! Hurry! What is your will? Does the Queen live or die? Orc, you will pay for this. Answer truthfully and live. Why do you die? You dictate terms, pig child. Give me back my sword and I'll give you a clean end. Ask your questions. Amuse me. Tell me what magic your king plans before you die. Terrified, or hurt you. <laughs> you should be. Warcaller. Kill me if you might. It is your choice. Does the priest live with you? Pray to Arke, Orc. Is there no hope? Mm -hmm. Kargoth! Our victory is near! We have the king's child. You killed everyone I love. Kargoth! I know I don't live there. My war card. There's no mm -hmm. honor in the slaughter of a broken people and defeated knights. Mm -hmm. If Renwick surrenders, he will join his people in exile. Let them spread word of our ferocity across the seas. And if he doesn't surrender, obviously blood price. Then I will cut him down. Stay your blade beyond this door, Targoth. Leave King Renwick to me. Understood. Get this door open, Targoth. Let's do this shit. Aliens! Damn you, help me! What's this? Yes, I feel your power. But how do you work? Renwick, surrender now, and I'll spare your worthless life. Stay back! I hold destruction in my hands. Magic cannot save you. Surrender or die! Leave now, or I'll use this relic to obliterate you! You will not harm my people! Draw steel! Help me! Help me, damn you all! Targoth, bury this elf-loving fool! Those who remain will accept exile or die. Mm -hmm. Even my.
my death failed my people. You tried to use the relic on the orcs and use gold claim the blood price under Malakath. Malakath's gun, didn't you? And is that basically you tried to commit abomination by using the relic. Is gold killed you under the code of Malakath? Yes. Once I summoned the relic's power, I realized what it demanded of me. Souls. It craves souls. I would not pay that price, but the Bloodthorn will. They will raise this undead army and slaughter you all. How can I stop them? The Aeliad Relic is the key, but my memories have faded with time. I no longer remember its location. I know only that you must find it before the Bloodthorn. I offer this knowledge as payment for the souls you saved today. Mm -hmm. The war was a long time ago. Once we've cleared out the cult, we'll rebury any bodies they've mm -hmm. been Even Breton dead deserve that dignity. Mm -hmm. I don't want them creeping into town at night. All right. This was a Breton island. Steel and stone, how could you? We're not savages. We respect. Mm -hmm. There we go. Yeah, peace, ancestors. What curse disturbs your rest? The souls of the dead are restless. Ancient warriors who died in battle. You are one of the newcomers, another of your group. His magic enables. We are not. Mori Selly. Narmo. Ah, oh, my old friend. Ah, oh, my old the mystery. Indeed, you just like old times, isn't it? I do like to have such a useful tool uh, ally with me. A proper application of magic to these stones, and the way is open. And then we'll hit the crown. Fortifying meal. And now we enter more side. Talk to the ghost of War Calling Targa. You are not one of them. You have not the taint. Help us. Free us from this torment.
Who are you? What's happening here? Tarkoth, war caller of the Stone Wolves. Cultists have violated my tomb and those of my warriors. The vile priestess Drusilla leads the cult, dragging our spirits back to this realm. In life, I wielded a magical war horn. My soldier, she is in the lower chambers. Kill her before she can send my soldiers against our descendants. That will free me from her bonds. There we go. Up to Targos goes. But my warriors still I overheard them mention the ruin of Karzog's demise. Whatever they're planning, it is return the horn to its rightful then you condemn my warriors to further degradation. We can either look it out of here with the horn or place the war horn up on top of the Targath tomb. The Targath tomb. Your efforts honor us, champion. I feel the spirits of my warriors return to rest, and so I shall follow. Be bold, warrior. The cultists still plague this island. He will meet them again, to their sorrow. Mm -hmm. No one said anything about haunted ruins and neck. Superbly done. Val cultist. Alrighty then. The spirits have vanished. Their valiant souls rest once again. Quickly. They release the Karzok's demise as the target. Spotted at Karzok's demise. Their intent is unknown. <laughs> Found you. We need mm -hmm. you. That's awful. Dr. Landlord. You're back. Bloodthorn cultists were sighted at those ruins. Chief Kazgul is leading. All the right. Chief Quickly to Karzogs to deal with this threat. Yes, sir. Fine goods for sale. Harsh, what's wrong? A 
Bloodthorns have raised a spectral army from the depths of the ruins. We can't defeat them. Get the wounded back to the fortress. We'll put an end to this. The cultists have somehow sealed the doors with the welcome stones. <coughs> Find a way into the ruins. Uh -huh. I need to find Colleen. There we go. Activate doorway crystal zero through three. Open to Carthlot's demise. Whoa. without us. Takes care of number two. There we go. It's opening. Get ready, everyone. There's no quiet. The enemy is weak. Alrighty then. These look valuable, don't they? Never been in ruins. Get into that uniform and act natural. Should fool some of them, at least.
Barjat's journal. Mm -hmm. The others have gone on ahead. Only a little ways ahead. All right. Death. Follow me, I know a shortcut. Let's go. We'll hold here as long as it takes. Talk to Nerima. I suspect that Vardan died when the portal closed. What took you so long? I suspect that Vardan... The Bloodthorns created uh -huh. to the spirit realm with this Welkin stone. Vardan is on the other side, commanding the spirits slaying the orcs. Without the Breton ritual Vardan used, only one without You're too late. My army feeds. Think about this. What's to think about? It killed hundreds of orcs. The cultist did that. In the right hands, this could defend the covenant against invaders. I'm not giving that thing to the people who leveled Orsinium. All right. The relic, ours at last, for the covenant. So you're sure we should keep it? Yes. Keep it and use it. A discovery like this could tip the war in our favor. Think of all the lives we could save. How would it save lives? With this relic, our enemies would not dare invade the Covenant. No more packed raids out of Skyrim. No Dominion fleets in our waters. I gotta think about this. Destroy the relic now! Didn't you hear the screams of- It's a hard decision. You must destroy it. Do not hand it to the ones who leveled Orsinium and try to exterminate all my kind. What do you mean Orsinium? Orsinium used to be the Orc homeland. Breton and Redguard kings have a nasty habit of burning it to the ground. Now the Covenant- This object is a curse, a danger to all. Mm -hmm. It can be turned against anyone as easily- Alright, for the others. You're not considering keeping that thing, are you? This relic is too powerful, it'll- This is a great moment. Why not? I'm the only one who might discover how it works. You can't hand it over to the fools who run the... Give it to me or destroy it. Those are the only choices I will accept. Uh -huh. This thing must be destroyed. Well, even I'm not so certain. Have you not listened to Kaleen? Her words betray visions of power over her enemies. This thing must be destroyed. We cannot allow this curse to fall upon anyone else. 
Well, it could be useful in the right hands. There are no right hands to hold this evil. It must be destroyed. I cannot say with one who would give this to those who lead the Covenant. Theresa if recruited as a reason that killing Faharaja will see that the relic ends up and save hands. Basically basically if we keep destroy the relic we piss off Colleen, Nicoline, Larissa. you to listen to me. Keep what the relic, please. My brothers are in the Covenant army. This could prevent war and save their lives. I can't make promises on this as yet. What do you mean? Didn't you hear me? I need Keep you to the relic, please. What do you mean? Didn't you? Larissa. First you appear out of nowhere and now I don't often agree with Colleen, but she's right. We must hand it over to the Covenant. King Faharajad will see that it's used responsibly. Well, I am a Meg King Faharajad person, so I wish I could weigh in, weigh in, my, weigh in by a little bit sir. Trust Colleen. She knows Faharajad, and she's convinced the relic can save lives. We side with Lambor or Colleen?
I cannot sail. You're going to hand the relic to those fools? This won't end well. Traitor! Out of my sight! How could you keep that thing? Easy, because it will save lives. Also, I am under good authority that it will end up getting handed over through two, uh, so handed over to the Mages Guild that, to find a way to empower it without soul letting. And they get used on Elgar Dominion forces in Daggerfall. It saves a lot of people in the city there, but it burns out after the use. So we don't have to technically worry about it as such. Ah. Off we go back to where we need to go. We'll talk to Chief Tazgol. You saved us. Thank you. So you decided the fate of the relic. What did you decide about the? I disapprove. Many of my people had their souls consumed by that thing. You've condemned others to the same fate. Even so, you saved my tribe. Mm -hmm. Tonight, I will respect your decision. Without you, we would all be dead. I hope you made the right choice. It is done. Other matters concern us now. What's Your this? actions have revealed a vulnerability. I thought my tribe safe on our island. Months ago, Sir Lannis offered membership in the Daggerfall Covenant. I refused. You showed me I was wrong. We need allies. I would ask you to travel to Glenumbra and give Sir Lannis my petition to join. I've ordered Captain Colleen to sail you there. I'll forward it. Mm-hmm. All right. Watch the Dark Hill City. One, two, three. There we go. Repair kit time! What? There we go. You made the right decision. Our homeland. I made a necessary decision. It may never necessarily be the right. I commend you again on choosing to keep the spearhead mm -hmm. is set to sail. Are you ready? Let's go. We've arrived. Welcome to Daggerfall.
Hold, adventurer! You're the one I seek. Those ladies are such fools! Jakarn and... I was so certain I wanted to sail with Captain Colleen. But I still can't believe she was in favor of keeping that awful relic. I think I might take Lambour's offer and join her crew. Alright. I will be blunt. You were a fool to trust a relic that powerful to these Bretons. If they do not use it for evil, they will harm themselves through their ignorance. We've arrived. Welcome to Daggerfall. I want to go back to Stros Mackay, but no one will sail me there. I will never forgive you for what you did. Mm -hmm. That is going to cause horrible suffering in the world. I'm leaving the ship, leaving Kaleen. Perhaps I'll go out on my own. Whatever happens, stay out of my way. Well, quite frankly, you'll know it's nec- You may not think it, but quite frankly, it is necessary. I wish you the best, but if you try and take a swing at me... No, I don't fucking go down fucking easy. So this is where we part ways, good looking. I still think you made the wrong decision, but I think I'll actually miss you. Alright. And now let's talk to all three of the women, Nazmat. The irony is delicious. You could cut it with a knife or anything. Elethian. We've all agreed. He's going to choose one way or the other, or we're throwing him off the boat. Mm -hmm. This is actually quite fun. Look at him squirm. I gotcha, I gotcha. There you are. Well now, a familiar face. How? Nicolene. I know the others have doubts, but that's their problem. If Captain Colleen believes the power of that relic can be used for good, mm -hmm. I do too. You did the right thing. When I see my brothers again, I'll tell them what you did for them. All right. Just keep in mind this, though. Even I'm still not 100% convinced this is the right move. But he's only trusting him because of those big puppy dog eyes of yours. And the fact that Colleen, neither of them really steered me wrong. I know that many aren't happy you kept the relic, but you made the right decision. Well, mm -hmm. that was an awful lot of drama, wasn't it? I think I'm about done here. It's time to sail on my own boat. see you again someday. Guess I was right. Lambour owes me dinner. We're here. Daggerfall. I hope we have time to re- Here it is. I think my hand's starting to heal. One day, I'm going back to Strosman Kai to take my vent. Mm -hmm. There you go. Helen. No! Oh, don't do that. To Michelle. You made a decision. The specifics do not matter. We would not be here if not for you. And Betnik would be in the hands of a cult. 
Mm -hmm. I don't know if I will sail with Kaleen or Lambur, mm -hmm. but I would sail with you any time. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Oh, don't mind me. And that takes care of all the crew of the spearhead here. Sir Lannis Sheldon. The city of Daggerfall greets you. Can I help you with something? I bring a petition from the Isle of Vetnik. Chief Tazgol of Vetnik wishes to join the Daggerfall Covenant. The Sea Mount War Chief? Impressive. I don't know what you did to convince him, friend. But you have my gratitude. Well done. I will take this petition to High King Emmerich immediately. Enjoy your stay in Daggerfall. Dankeschön. And with that, we have gotten Sir Lannis' stuff dealt with, and that actually puts us on to... Daggerfall in Wayrest. Which we will get started on next time. But seriously, folks, it is wonderful having you all here, by the way. And thank you all for tuning in. Oh yeah, easy. Um, uh, catch this earlier, and I do apologize, but yeah, this is the new class that you were seeing. It freaking snaps, and especially with update thirty nine coming out. But from yours truly, we end with it being two fifty two. Do take care of yourselves out there, folks. We're all in this together. See you all Thursday, where we start a new streaming week. Until then, peace out. I'll see you when I see you. Uh, that's taken care of. Onward to Twitch, where we will dump y'all off with a nice, wonderful place to raid. Speaking of raiding... Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. There are just so many options here today. Option A, option B. E. Okay, now you just made it triply difficult. Actually, probably a little bit less, but... <sighs> as much as I really want to... I cannot resist this! I mean, if you're gonna cross Disney over with something, at least it's not fucking... Since where Enix, at the very least, cross it over some zombies. I mean, that at least throws some iron in this shit. Alrighty then. But yeah, we'll be dropping in on the last bit of the team, you guys here, provided that we can give them a raid. Can we... Uh, read them! Si, sí, senor! So, we'll be joining them in June.
moment. Until next time, folks. Peace.